Hi, my name is Cheryl Spangler, the founder of RichNicheAcademy.com, and I have a YouTube channel dedicated to funnel hacking for realtors. But in this YouTube video, I'm just going to show you how to add a subdomain using your GoDaddy account and connect it to your ClickFunnels account. And I'm not going to miss a step, so you will be able to do everything from this one video. Go to GoDaddy.com, log in to your account. I'm already logged in. And go to Manage Domains. You want to choose the domain that we are going to add a subdomain to. In this case, I'm going to add a test subdomain to richnicheacademy.com. I'm creating a funnel, a test funnel. So I want a subdomain that I can constantly be testing. You might be adding a subdomain for whatever it is you're doing. Scroll So go to your domain, scroll down to the bottom, click on Manage DNS. This is the first step of adding a subdomain in your GoDaddy account. You literally go to Manage DNS, go down and click Add. Click CNAME. CNAME is what is CNAME is the name of your subdomain. So if you want to create a subdomain of in my case, richnicheacademy.com, I want to create a subdomain called test. Now, the confusing part to me on all the other videos I watched is I said to myself, so how do I add the subdomain? By naming the word test, by putting the word test in there. I could, I could say blog. It could be blog.richnicheacademy.com. You can see up here I created um, join for my membership. I created Cheryl, that's the home, that's all about me, blog, affiliate. I guess what I'm saying is the confusing part about every other video I've watched is no one says the name, the subdomain name literally gets created by putting it in this line. So in this case, I'm creating a subdomain, richnicheacademy.com slash test and this creates it. There is no other step to create the subdomain other than choosing CNAME, choosing the name of the subdomain, and then in this case I'm pointing the subdomain to my ClickFunnels account. Now I'm going to create another subdomain because I have another test funnel I want to create. My job in GoDaddy is done. I literally just created two subdomains and now I have to go to step two. Step two is I go to my click funnel. Account. I go to the top right. Scroll down to domains. It brings up all my domains. I don't have the subdomains that I just added, so I'm going to add one. So first you create in your GoDaddy account, then you go to ClickFunnel, create. I'm going to use an existing domain. And I'm going to add the subdomain I just added. Test.richnicheacademy.com Some things that I have done wrong when it didn't work was I tried to put www in front of it, I tried to put http in front of it, no. Once you add your subdomain in GoDaddy, go into ClickFunnels and right here you just start with the name of the subdomain dot your domain dot com. Add domain. Now if you added it into GoDaddy, when you click I've done this step, it's going to find it and say yay good job you did it. Test dot richnicheacademy.com is connected and ready to use. I don't have a funnel created yet for this test, so I'm just not going to associate a funnel to it. I'm just going to say, show me my domains. 
Now I'm going to add that second domain, subdomain that I added through GoDaddy. Use an existing domain. Test2.richnicheacademy.com. Add domain. Yes, I've connected my domain to ClickFunnel already. That was the first step. Let's check that test2.richnicheacademy.com is connected. Check now. Okay, so something didn't work. Did I not name it properly? Let's double check. Oh, see, test one. I actually, my C name was actually test one, not test two. So you can see that it connected uh, the one labeled test, but not test one because I, I named it wrong. So let's, um, let's go back to domains. See, so whatever you decide to name your subdomain in GoDaddy, when you go to add the domain here, um, oops, I know that's not going to verify. So it's coming up with an, an error. So let me just add a new one, which is the one I, what I really called it, test one. Test one dot rich niche. Academy.com. Now, how have I already added it in GoDaddy? Good job, you did it! Test one dot richness academy is connected. I don't have a funnel to associate it with, so I'm just going to go back to show my domains. Yay! There we go. And so this test two, I will need to delete. And there you go. You now have added a subdomain to your GoDaddy account and affiliated it within ClickFunnels. So now you can go create a bunch of funnels off the same subdomain and not have to go buy a thousand domains. Just create a bunch of subdomains in GoDaddy and affiliate them to funnels in ClickFunnel and you are good to go.